Hello from Kelly Hick, where we're looking in Quail Ridge Park Model Trailers. I just gave a tour of the 39 AKFFL. This particular one here is called a 39 CBDL. It's unit number 12187. It is clay with white corners, white windows and trim. Good looking trailer. Has a large walk of bay, house type rear entry door with the fancy mini blind in it. Got your auxiliary air conditioner. You got a spigot, outside spigot, frost freeze, outside spigot, that's standard on a quail ridge. Have auxiliary air conditioner up in the loft area. It's a triple axle, it's 14 and a half foot tall. Let's go on in and have a look around. Again, this one's available for sale. Got any questions, call Kelly or message me. Going on in, one thing I like about this trailer and what I think sells a lot of it, it seems to have about the most cabinets of any trailer. A lot of cabinets in it. Cabinets. I put stainless appliances in this one, so that means it has a 30 inch convection microwave. It also has a 30 inch range, stainless kitchen sink with the lifetime warranty, single lever faucet with pull out sprayer, 56,000 BTU stand up furnace, table and four chairs. There is actually storage under the chairs. We have linoleum on the entire main floor with carpet in the loft and master bedroom only. Let's go back out and finish our tour of the living room. We have a end table and lamp, coffee table, a sleeper sectional sofa, or pit group, whatever you care to call it, trapezoid window, ceiling fan overhead, Room for pretty much any size TV you would like. Uh, footstool. Footrest, I should say. Got the fireplace going. I don't know if you can see it. But anyhow, I've seen people put 75-inch TVs up on these. And they fit just fine. I don't know if I'd put one that big. This is butter rum cabinetry. Let's go in the bathroom next. The kitchen is great. There's your kitchen cabinets. Plus you have the U-shaped wraparound cabinets behind me. Uh, there is storage under the stairs, as always. This has the Neo-Angle shower, which lets it have an additional closet in the bathroom. I ordered it this way. It's shower only. But you also get this extra cabinet in here for storage. It makes this a super duper trailer with even more cabinets than anything else. The threshold is low. It's about a five or five inch threshold perhaps. Window, porcelain toilet, nice medicine cabinet. GFI outlet, storage underneath, heading on into the bedroom, again this is butter rum, solid doors, mini blind inside the window, inside the door rather, Oop. there we go, see out, not see out, okay, We'll let the people see in. Uh, you have your standard Quail Ridge wardrobe. Eight drawers and four doors. Lights in the closet. Queen bed. It's a freestanding queen. So you can move it wherever you want. Turn on the closet light. There you go. See what you're looking at. Over here. 
all the ball all the drawer guides are ball bearing full extension drawer guides so you can load up your drawers and have access to all of them again this has the nice carpet on your feet in the bedroom but once you clear the bedroom there you are linoleum let's head for the loft show you what the loft looks like heading upstairs into the loft this is a big loft it covers about two-thirds of the trailer so it's one of our biggest loft models it's got a small entertainment center for the TV it's got some storage up here and again it has the auxiliary air conditioner which will keep your guests cool while they're sleeping they have their own air conditioner when they're up here that's an auxiliary that's in addition there's that's in addition to the central air that's provided okay so heading on down show you around a little bit but we're pretty much through with this video hope i showed you around well if you leave me some good comments i'll keep making more videos okay if you got any questions or want to purchase call kelly this is the quail ridge loft 39 cbdl number one two one eight seven have a great day We're looking at Forest River Park Model Trailers today. Specifically, this is a Quail Ridge 39CBDL. It's unit number 12187, and its MSRP is only about $62,000. i will tell you all about it. It's clay colored with white corners and white trim and white lineals. It's got a house type rear entry door and I think we should probably go on in and take a look around. Looking over here, you've got where this little circle is, is where an outside light goes, which is included. And then by the patio, six foot vinyl patio door, you also have another entry light. So let's go on in and have a look around. This has a lot of nice features in it, not the least of which is a fireplace and a sectional sofa. If you come over here, this would be the place for you to fill out your credit app. We got the furnace hooked up. It'd be nice and toasty in here. Sleeper sofa. You've got a kick out footstool on this side there's the fireplace which is functional throws out heat if you want it to right now I simply got it being a nice little decoration there is uh, PVC flooring looks like ceramic tile throughout the entire main floor Everything in them stays in them. And there's carpet in the steps, the master bedroom, and the loft area only. Everything in them stays in them. All the furnishings are included. Just need a 50 amp electrical service and hook them up to the sewer and away you go. Some of the cabinets here. A lot of nice cabinets in this model. A lot of adjustable shelving. See the adjustable shelving in there. Oops. Uh, there's storage under the seats. You got a stainless steel 30 inch range. Stainless steel 30 inch convection microwave. 18 and a half cubic foot stainless fridge uh, lots more cabinets in here 
There's the outside light. All drawers feature the ball bearing full extension drawer guides. Here's some more cabinetry for you. Data manufacturer. And the serial number, 12187. You got a stainless steel faucet, stainless steel sink, and a pull-out sprayer. Forest River is definitely in the 20th century. There's outlets included with USB charging jacks. That five burner range is better than the one I have at home. Uh, again, you're looking at the linoleum throughout the entire main floor. We just got that carpet in there to wipe your feet on. There's storage under the steps. Pretty good storage under there. Uh, this has the corner shower, neo-angle shower, so that allows for an extra cabinet in the bathroom. If this had the tub shower surround, you would definitely lose this cabinet. I think this cabinet's important for linens and towels and such. There's a low threshold, so it's not hard to step in the shower. It's about a four inch threshold down there. There's the shower. Functional. Window. You have a medicine cabinet with shelving for all your medicine needs. DFI outlet. Sink and vanity. Porcelain house type toilet. Heading into the hallway. Here's one of the cool features that this one has. 56,000 BTU furnace. So if you're in a colder climate, the 56,000 BTU furnace will really shine for you. In addition, you have that electric fireplace up front that pretty much will heat the whole place by itself. The It has a queen bed with the Dreamscape Serta mattress. Always comfortable. See the little sheep? It's a queen. Uh, the door has a built-in blind. So we can close off the outside world. Or look out at the outside world. Because of COVID, we're short some nightstands. But by the time you buy this, we'll have a nightstand for you. There's the lamp. And again, the drawers have the ball bearing full extension drawer guides. So you can extend them out all the way and load them up with goodies. Uh, behind the mirror here will be the breaker panel. That's where the circuit breakers are located. And of course, they're all clearly marked as to what they're for. I'll show you inside of the closet. There's two of these. It's called the his and hers wardrobe. We jokingly refer to them as hers and hers. But there's a closet rod, plenty of room for hanging things. Mini blinds on every window that opens and closes. Okay, I guess we should go look at the loft since that's all we have left to see. I did this one in lineal instead of fisheye. I know a lot of people will appreciate that, but you don't get as wide of a view and it's hard to get a good film job going on in one of these trailers. Everybody says you move too fast or the fisheye makes me dizzy. Well, watch the ones that are lineal then. Okay, heading on up to the loft. It's a nice big loft. Probably one of the biggest ones we have to offer. Covers about two thirds of the trailer. There's a small entertainment center with a couple drawers. There's an auxiliary 
5,000 BTU air conditioner to keep people cool up here in the summertime. There's no problem with heat rising, so you never had to worry about being warm up here. The 56,000 BTU will more than take care of that. Um, and then overlooking the front room here. Okay, I'm going to head back down the stairs. The loft area is about four foot tall at the peak. This is another what you call a flat floor loft. There's no step down into the master bedroom, which is what a lot of people are looking for. They don't want to trip and fall as they age. Your eyesight goes, your knees go. There's no step down. Solid core doors. This was the butter rum cabinetry which is actually pretty good looking cabinet. One of our more popular colors. Dining area. Front room. This is the 39 CBDL. It's a Quail Ridge 39 CBDL loft. Thanks for looking. I hope you enjoyed the video. This is Kelly Hicks signing off. Myself wondering what did happen to the last ten? I ran away with my life fast forward, never turned back again. It's kind of funny that the more we pass time, the more we need to set the rewind. And 19 was the year I had to leave you, but now I'm seeing all the signs. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just as surprised as you. Myself wondering what did happen to the last ten. 
Ran away with my life fast forward Never turn back again It's kind of funny that the more we pass time The more we need to set the rewind And our team was the year I had to leave you But now I'm seeing all the signs Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true I'm just as surprised as you Just open the door, one thing certain, I'll always be 